Aloha. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and thank you for joining me today on this live stream. My name is Master Paul, and it is the 21st day of February. My, oh my, how this month has just flown by. And it looks as though it will be even faster as we move forward into 2019. Uh, today we're going to be focusing on the greatest light. A little repeat there on my own <laughs> computer. Um, looks like we're going to be moving forward very quickly. So today we're going to be focusing on the greatest light, Da Guang Ming. Now this, of course, is a Mandarin Chinese word. Da means the greatest. Guang means light. The greatest light, Da Guang Ming. And today we're going to be focusing on that and receiving blessings from the Da Guang Ming oneness yibitsa calligraphy so I probably will not be here the entire uh, time I normally do one hour today I'll probably be a little bit shorter um, because I have quite a bit of a, uh, tasks to accomplish today but I look forward to serving you in this short period of time that you are present <clears throat> and so uh, yesterday was probably the first nice day we've had here in Hawaii we've had pretty miserable weather most of this month which is not normal for a beautiful place like this so I'm very happy to be outside how is it where you are at let me know and meanwhile we'll check in welcome Samba welcome Pranjal Aloha to Archana Dev welcome Rosetta Aloha Abninder Master Ab Abhi welcome Dan Aloha Roshandal welcome also to Suzanne Aloha Tone, welcome Priti, and also Aloha and welcome to Susanna. Thank you all for your presence. So welcome also to Bradley, and uh, if I missed anybody, forgive me. Thank you for your presence. Thank you for clicking on the share button. Each and every uh, live stream, I try to bring a wisdom to you that can serve you on your soul journey, assist you in moving forward each and every day. But sometimes we just need more light in our life. And when Master Shah uh, released the ten da, which is the ten greatest qualities of life, uh, they were not meant to be <clears throat> limited to um, the obvious. Uh, and light is one of those unobvious ones. It's not necessarily mentioned too much when you look at all the scriptures or any of the, the ancient teachings of the last hundred thousand years. We don't talk a lot about light but light is literally what the universe is made up of and love is what fills in that light so we're going to talk about today the greatest light and how you can have more of it in your life prior to doing that we're going to go ahead and connect <clears throat> as i always do in my live streams using this soul song of love peace and harmony and we do that by placing our hands in a prayer position or you can drop your left hand in front of your heart center which is called the soul light soul service hand position and this will allow us to connect and I will invite you to close your eyes while we invite in the beings of light so that we can all align our hearts and souls together more so let us begin dear our beloved divine creator all the beings of light and love serving the planet of the light side Masters and Ascended Masters, Gurus, Lamas, Sifus, and Saints, Buddhas and Bodhisattvas, dear the soul of our own Heaven's team, guides, angels, and saints, we love you all, we honor you all, deeply appreciate and respect you all. We ask for your presence at this time <clears throat> to bring more light into our life, to awaken and open us to the light that we live in. We are extremely grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, dear the song of love, peace, and harmony, we love you, honor you, appreciate you. As we chant you, could you please clear blockages in our current life as appropriate and open our hearts and souls to receiving more love and light? We're extremely grateful. Thank you. <clears throat> so for all of you that know this song, I encourage you to sing along with me. For those that do not, this is a blessing. You may make a request and receive. So let us sing from our hearts one round, love, peace, and harmony. <coughs> Excuse me. Lula, Lula, Lee. 
Lu la lu la la li Lu la lu la li lu la Lu la li lu la Lu la ha li lu la Wo ai wo xin ha li Wo ai tlan nan li Rang li ng rong ha r mu shir shong Shong ai ping on a xin Shong ai ping on a xin I love my heart and soul. I love all humanity. Join hearts and souls together. Love, peace, and harmony. Love, peace, and harmony. Ha, ha, ha. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome also to Ravina. Welcome Anne Marie. Welcome Jen. Uh, Aloha Sage Lee. Welcome Janet. Aloha Felix. And um, welcome also uh, Nora Patacho. Welcome Zaid Baba. Aloha. Thank you for your presence. Today we're going to be talking about Da Guang Mi, which translates to the greatest light. <coughs> da Guang Mi. Uh, is Mandarin Chinese, and Da means the. Uh, Guang means greatest. Ming means light, the greatest light. And it is one of ten qualities that Master Shah has introduced to humanity. For those that are not familiar with Master Shah or these ten qualities, they are Da I, the greatest love, Da Quan Shu, the greatest forgiveness, greatest love, greatest forgiveness. Who does not want those qualities in their life? Uh, da Tsi Bei, the greatest compassion. Da Guang Ming is the fourth one, the greatest light. There is Da Chen Bei, Da Chen Bei, which is the greatest humility. Da He She, the greatest harmony. Da Gan An, the greatest gratitude. There is Da Chang Sheng, which is the greatest flourishing who doesn't want more flourishing in their life right there's da fu the greatest service and finally the capstone of the ten greatest qualities is da yuan man the greatest enlightenment <clears throat> and the wisdom that master Shah has brought to us is that when we bring these qualities of the greatest love light forgiveness compassion the greatest humility greatest flourishing greatest gratitude the greatest service then we can receive the greatest enlightenment by simply applying these qualities more and more in each and every day in our life. Welcome, Victor. Welcome, Bari. And so give me a moment. And so today, by focusing on the greatest light, what is the power and significance of the greatest light and how can we improve that in our life? Why do we need more light in our life? What does it really mean to have more light in our life? What I'm going to do is I'm going to do a quick flow. I'm going to ask Kevin, what does it mean to have more light in our life? How does that manifest in our life? And, and why do we need more of it? What will we do with it if we have more of it? And then what we're going to do is we're going to uh, use one of Master Shah's uh, blessings that he's left with humanity. He's left it in the form of a Ibiza oneness calligraphy. And he's such a benevolent being, Master Shah. He knows that he, uh, he he's talked about longevity being here forever, but I don't think a being of light of his caliber wants to be in this uh, place of earth that can get a little dirty and a little unfun at times. Uh, I think that he's probably going to want to return back to the source uh, and enjoy more light. <clears throat> it's just a lot less here. But in his service to humanity, he has brought tools and techniques to serve us so that humanity can continue to prosper and awaken and grow in light. So we'll uh, use those blessings in just a little bit. But first, I'm going to start by offering 
divine guidance as to the nature, power, and significance of why we need more light in our life. Welcome, Yota. Welcome, Archana Pawa. Uh, welcome also to Adam Gil. <coughs> Close your eyes. Receive this wisdom. Dear our beloved divine creator, could you please borrow my mouth, offer a flow of information to all those listening as to what is the nature, power, and significance of having light in our life? What is the value to us by having more of it in our life, and how can it serve us? Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> how? This is the soul of the quality Dong Wang Mi. I have been an aspect of all creation since the beginning of creation, which was before the beginning of time. Light permeates all life. All life literally could not be sustained without light. In what is called the darkness or dark matter, the stuff of creation, there is extraordinary light. Light should not be limited to the human comprehension. Light is waves of creator in all its forms. You have given what you refer to as colors to represent light or light spectrum. But do not be confused that this is all there is. There are those that have opened their spiritual channels that see different spectrum of light than can be seen by the majority. <clears throat> there are those that have great light in their hearts and that light shows up in so many different ways when we open our heart to more love and more light we are in essence opening our heart to humanity and to all creation it is amongst the most extraordinary aspects of your existence. By opening the heart to your beloved creator, you in essence allow the concept of enlightenment to occur. And with enlightenment, you literally meld with all things. To be able to meld with all things is to understand all things. To be able to meld with all things is to be able to create miracles. To be able to meld with all things is to be an enlightened being. So there is insufficient amounts of light in humanity. Even these simple practices that you are doing will serve you. Even these simple practices today will bring more light to your vessel, thereby lightening your load. So in a simple sentence, to add more light to your life is to lighten your load and to bring you closer to source. The wisdom on this would take lifetimes to comprehend. This is enough 
for now. This is the soul of Dagon Ning, the greatest light. How, how, how. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> so thank you, the soul of Dagon Ning, for that message. I hope the wisdom in there served you. I'm going to have to go back and listen to it because my attention was somewhere else and this soul just kept talking so I really don't know what was coming out at this time. Uh, welcome also to Laila Lee. Welcome Nikki. <clears throat> Thank you for your presence. So now let's receive more light, shall we? So what Master Shah did was he understood that humanity is suffering and so he came as many high-level beings do and incarnated back in this uh, existence to serve human beings and to assist them to move through and past the suffering that they're going through and he brought great tools to accomplish this many of them have been placed within his books uh, so if you're not familiar with them please learn more about dr. and master Shah purchase one or two of his books just reading a little bit will open your heart to understand the great wisdom with them and as a being of light he has received uh, various wisdoms authorities and powers including the ability and power to transmit uh, heaven's frequency heaven's blessings into <coughs> excuse me into a um, uh, objects and things he can also of course transmit these powers to people but in this case he has transmitted them to what's called a calligraphy card now this calligraphy card See if I set this up correctly. Should work pretty well right there. Um, this calligraphy card is called Da Guang Ming, the greatest light. The first symbol is Da Guang Ming, the greatest light. And so the greatest light can serve us. This carries a frequency and a vibration, a wavelength, as mentioned by the the soul of Da Guang Ming that spoke to me, uh, this carries a wavelength that is a far greater alignment to source than you or I presently are in, probably. Maybe you're, you carry a good high presence, but most of us are, are carrying a frequency that includes frustration, anger, fear, worry, sadness, grief, uh, concerns about the day financial things relationship things and blah 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 and they tend to bog down our light and so all of us need a bit more of this so with this calligraphy what we do and how you receive light from it is you ask it to serve you and master Shah's wisdom everything is here to serve this soul the soul of Daguang Ming came to speak through me and it indicated it's been here since the beginning before time actually it's here to serve us so when we connect with it from a heart level that all the uh, radiant beings of light that can come through this portal of, of energy if you will will come to us and bring more light to us help us clear our fears worries concerns etc so I will walk you through how to connect to this and you can actually uh, access this calligraphy card if you'd like to you can co contact me uh, you can get it through any of the centers. If you do it through me, the honor fee is $50, and then uh, you know, $5 more for mailing it to you. That's optional. It's certainly not while I'm here to talk to you about. It's just if it's something you want, you can do it that way. But in the meantime, let us utilize this service, okay? So placing our hands in prayer position or dropping your left hand in front of your heart center called the Soul Light Soul Service Hand Position. Let us close our eyes, and I will walk you through connecting to this calligraphy, and then we will do what's called tracing it. So close your eyes first. And repeat after me. Dear the soul of the calligraphy, Da Guang Ming, the greatest light, the countless blessings, layers of light from the heavenly realms placed within this beautiful piece of love art. I love you, honor you, deeply appreciate you. As I trace you, could you please bring your greatest light into my soul, heart, mind, and body? You can make a specific request here. Could you bless me for the condition of 
and you can say my finances don't do 10 things just choose one thing but make your request that's okay and then offer your gratitude I'm so grateful thank you thank you thank you gratitude is huge you will get so much more light when you offer gratitude so now you just place your fingers together like this and you trace the calligraphy and we'll chant together Dagwang Ming and and the light is coming to you but it's okay to visualize the light coming to your area of request okay so let us trace together and chant Da Guang Ming 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 And start tracing slower. Make it a very meditative action. Greatest light, greatest light, greatest light, greatest light. Greatest light, greatest light, greatest light, greatest light. Dagwang Ming Dagwang Ming Dagwang Ming of you that would like to balance your left and right hemispheres you can switch hands and trace with the other hand da guang ming da guang ming da guang Greatest light, greatest light, greatest.
it is light great is life you to repeat after me dear the soul of da guang ming the greatest light most blessed greatest light calligraphy and all the beings within thank you for serving me for the next few minutes while i trace could you please bless others for the condition that i requested so if you requested blessings for your finances stop Request the blessings to go to others that have financial problems. If you requested blessings for migraine headache or back pain, stop. Request the blessings for others that have this condition. As appropriate, repeat, this blessing is as appropriate. So now continue to trace, but now it's not for yourself. See the light going to bless others with your same condition. Let us begin. Da Guang Ming Da Guang Ming Da Guang Ming Da Guang Ming Greatest light, greatest light, greatest light, greatest light. Da Guang Ming Greatest Light Da Guang Ming Greatest Light One more minute Da Guang Ming Greatest Light Da Guang Ming Greatest Light Da Guang Ming, 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 Da Guang Ming. This is called Yang chanting. Da Guang Ming, 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 Da Guang Ming. How, 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 thank you, thank you, thank you. So let's offer our gratitude to all the beings of light, blessings and more that have come through this medium of the Da Guang Ming Ibitsu Oneness Calligraphy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> so for those that came in late, you can go back uh, to after about the first eight minutes or so when we start going into the blessings 
Welcome, Megan. Welcome, Ani. And by tracing this Daguang Ming calligraphy each and every day, you can receive huge light. Uh, you can come back and watch this video and just continue to trace it if you'd like. If you want to know if a pair of sweet tasted, if you want to know if this works, then you must experience it. Master Shah has brought these calligraphies to humanity to serve. I invite you to his uh, events coming up March 16 and 17, where he is doing an event at the Four Seasons. And the registration for uh, online or in person is only $50, and it includes a blessing, like a miracle of a blessing. So it's kind of hard to pass up the honor fee. It's just really, really generous. Uh, it might be 75 now. It, it, you know, it was there was an early bird special. But I tell you, my wife received one of these. We honored, I think it was $100, and she had 18 years of pain on her left side of her back from an auto accident. And I did some blessings that it ran up to her neck and into her head, and, and that reduced it by about 50%. But the level of blockage was higher than my power. And we were at a retreat locally here, and Master Shah literally had recorded the blessing. He wasn't even around. He was off meditating somewhere. He recorded the blessing onto a video, and at the retreat, <clears throat> he he, they played the video and just offered the blessing that way. And I told my wife to stand up and make a request, so we, she requested for this. And literally her pain has been gone ever since. Just gone. And it came from a record, recording into a video. How is this possible? Because power can be transmitted to anything if the one giving the power is an authentic servant of the Creator. And Master Shah takes no credit for the blessings. He gives all credit to the Divine. So learn more. Attend his uh, March 16 and 17 event. He will be doing Tao calligraphy demonstration and delivering the blessings. And you can learn by going to drshah.com, drsha.com. Uh, just scroll to the bottom of the page on the left-hand column. You'll see the registration there. And um, do register. It's online. You don't have to be there in person. And it's dirt cheap for the blessings you get. It's just extraordinary. It will save your life. It will change your life. I recommend everybody uh, register for at least one of the three or four sessions that he's offering, okay? <clears throat> of course, if you'd like to have your own calligraphy card, you can go to any center, call any center. They can send them to you, or you can pick them up from there. I can do one for you, send it to you if you'd like, but the honor fee for the card is $50, and then uh, $5 to mail it to you, unless you're out of the country and it costs me $13 or something like that. It does cost that much for some locations. Um, but uh, you can find these at any of the centers as well. So I'm grateful for the opportunity to serve you. Thank you for coming today. If you came in late, please watch from the beginning. You'll get not only the wisdom, but more blessings. Love you, love you, love you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I invite you. Uh, actually, this Sunday, I will not be doing the, uh, the chanting to serve humanity, uh, singing love, peace, and harmony for those with cancer. Normally, I do that on Sundays, but I'll be traveling this Sunday. And so I will not be uh, on the live stream on that day. So I will see you all next week on Tuesday. Bye-bye, everybody.